On today's episode of Watch Chair Go, I'm gonna try to do something I have no clue how to do. We're going to try to level off the bumpers and all these uh, plastic scrapes and paint the car. What is going on guys? I am Watch Chair Go, and today we're here with the 2000 Accord Coupe EX, and of course you've all seen the uh, front lip down on the bumper badly needs painted. So uh, I came out here with my DA. I've got 220 grit on it. It probably should have been a lower grit sandpaper, but you know, 220 is what I got laying around for the DA. And I've been trying to sand down all the scraping marks on the bumper here. Uh, I did a little bit right here. Of course, there's a crack right there I can't do anything about. But I'm just trying to level it a little bit, and then we'll come back with some alcohol, uh, wipe everything down, call that our prep, and then hit it with some spray paint. It also looks like I need to hit a little bit of the bumper itself right there with some alcohol. Uh, uh, I have been driving the car, so it's dirty again after our detail. Uh, it'd be cool if I could hit that little rust spot. I don't know if I'll be able to, uh, but we'll see. Get the bumper done. I bought a newspaper so we can use it for masking. Uh, I want to hit the rust spots. That would be awesome so I could stop the rust. And uh, I've got rust converter too, some CRC rust converter that might help. And uh, then of course, I need to sand this. This one's rough right here. Hit that. Hit this. I did just reattach the bumper. We pulled it off. Put these clips back in. Put the screws back where they belong. And uh, oh, what else? Oh, this one. I had to pull this clip, and this one doesn't hold exactly like it's supposed to. But this clip is screwed back in where it belongs. So let's get this sanded. Do a little bit of prep. We'll just wipe it down with alcohol because most of it's plastic where we're working. At least the bumpers are. And uh, then we'll mask with newspapers quickly and throw some paint on this. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. And I also bought some clear. But I talked to a painter friend of mine because I have zero experience painting cars. I honestly, I consider it to be an art and only body guys should do it. But hey, I mean, you can make something happen yourself, I assume. Let's get to work and hopefully it looks good at the end of the day. All right, so we're gonna hit this spot even though the plastic's all cracked out. Even covering up the black will make the car look better. So that's what we're going for. I definitely should have bought high build primer. All right, we just finished wiping down the front bumper and I'll show you what these look like with a little bit of alcohol. I should probably tighten this down and get some spray. Oh yeah. This, after we had high build primer on it, is going to be nice. It's pretty smooth. It had like little fingers from the plastic sticking up. It's gonna look great. You can see I doled out the paint up here. So we're gonna blend all the way back to here probably. All right, let's hit this spot. And all of these spots. Oh, my eyes. Sorry, did it go <laughs> in your eyes? <laughs> all right, I think we're ready for our paint. We're not trying to do some show quality paint job here. We're trying to get this car to not have giant black patches all over it. And uh, we're gonna pick up some high build primer real quick, be right back, uh, lay the primer on after we do a little bit of masking and do some painting. Jake's rocking and rolling with the uh, masking tape here, covering up the headlight. Uh, you can see I already hit the entire lower front bumper with uh, high build primer. It doesn't look like I got too much overspray on things, but let's try to make sure. Also, this stuff dries amazingly fast. This is a uh, high build primer, duplicolor, two in one filler and sandable primer. Our goal was really to make a, a nice base so we wouldn't have all these big black spots to deal with while we're painting. I think we're getting there really quickly. The only thing I want to do is try to mask off this little bitty section here, even though you can tell it's actually been painted before onto the gasket. Cool. I'm just kind of carefully trying to watch the spray and doing one of those. So adding a little bit of build here and there. Tell them about the tornadoes, John Ross. Yeah, the tornadoes are coming as well. So we're trying to really hurry on this paint job. This is gonna go really quick. As you can see, we're gonna spray a little. Oh, nice, nice. I like that idea too. I thought about, I wish I had the wheel covers, you know? Yeah. All right, let's, we've got a little bit of wind. We're gonna let that stop real fast. A couple more seconds here, I think we're good. All right. That's about it. We're kind of coming in with coats just like that. 
and then I'll let that dry for a second and hit it one more time. And then I'll go ahead and do the corner, I guess. The entire corner is getting done. Okay, the rain's starting. We just felt a couple drips on us. So we're needing to actually hurry and we'll get it done super fast. So we're gonna go ahead and hit the rust real quick. Wow, that light helps a lot. That should stop our rust. The scope of this project has expanded somewhat. So big. <laughs> anyway, we're about out of primer, but at least we've got a nice build and then I feather it as we move out. So I'm gonna hit this one more time. And then kind of blend it with that spot there. Even though I don't know what blending means. Yeah, we have plenty on the front. The front looks ready to paint. All right, let's start with the most important spot, which is the camera is covered with paint. <laughs> okay, we're gonna get this knocked out and see if I know how to paint. Tyler said light coats. Probably more alcohol too. What do I do with the alcohol? Prep. So if this goes poorly, can you just blame it on the alcohol? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> what else would we do, T-Pain? <laughs> okay, for these two little rust spots. We went ahead and masked all of this gasket off with some vinyl wrap, and that should help us, uh-oh, uh water. It's hard to tell where you've already painted. It really is. It's the same color as the primer. Yeah, the primer is really good, actually. Better than I expected. So one of my vinyl suppliers, back when I owned my sign shop, would ship us this stuff. I've never used it in my life, but we just found that it makes really good paint mask. So uh, we're just kind of blowing through it. It was free. And honestly, it's like the perfect size for this gasket. Sorry. <laughs> well, it's raining pretty hard now. We had to stop almost immediately, but we've got lots of paint coverage. I'm gonna come back and hit it again, I guess tomorrow night. Unfortunately, that means we're stuck for today and the storm's supposed to get worse. So, uh, you know, it looks silver now. That's pretty good. You can see there's no more big black spots on the car. We've got paint on just about everything, except they still primer right there. I'm gonna have to mask one more time. I'll vinyl wrap that and then uh, hit it again. And uh, yeah, some of this looks really good. You can't really tell. All right, it's the next day. The rain has stopped for a few minutes. It's pretty humid. Honestly, this all came out okay. Last night we were still finishing up our painting while it started to rain and I had to sit there and pop some rain bubbles and stuff like that, but uh, it's relatively smooth. The color match is really good. Here's the best place to see it. Uh, you can see it's slightly darker in there, but for the most part, it does blend into the uh, actual factory color. Uh, that's the update on the paint. Let's get back to painting. And uh, another storm's coming tonight and it's supposed to rain for the next two days after that. And these are like torrential downpours with, <laughs> they're always saying that there's gonna be a tornado every night. It does almost look like it matches a little bit better once more paint's on it. This is the second coat. Hit the front bumper one more time. So you're gonna sell the car at night, right? <laughs> <laughs> you know how bad I am at masking things? <laughs> Which is crazy, you know, you did the vinyl wrap. I know, but that's freaking awesome compared to paint. Paint is art, vinyl wrap is just science. And there go the masking materials. John Ross, quick take up the lead. Oh, and he captures it. Let's see if we can collect them all. John Ross has captured them all. <laughs> what are you gonna do next? That did blend pretty well. It does. Magic. 
And that is it for the Accords paintwork. Uh, the car looks silver again. Of course, you can still see some of the issues where the gouging was really deep in the plastics or where it's cracked, obviously right there and right there. There was a lot of gouging. And even after a lot of that high build primer, I didn't get anywhere. So we just went for the paint and it looks okay. The car is mostly silver, except for the areas I didn't mess with. I didn't want to get up here and have to worry about the grill or in here and have to worry about that grill. So I was relatively careful. You have to pick your battles on these, of course. Uh, there's a bit of a trade-off between trying to mask quickly or should I just remove the part and try to paint it on a bench or a stand or something. And uh, here the option was, let's move quickly. So, uh, you know, everything looks silver almost all the way around the car. I'm happy with it. So now let's go finish up that window and this car is wrapped. I'm super excited to finally see it go. X just changed this dude's alternator for him in the parking lot at O'Reilly's. Mad skills. So he's got a whole cart out here. He's got all the, his bearing bad? It's probably just a bad alternator right no, now. No, it's the, the voltage regulator. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Got all the tools out here and uh, he's grinding away. Getting ready to drop the new one in right now. More Honda things. Here you go. Gross. I'll try. <laughs> so, I don't know, 15 more minutes. What, how long did it take you to get out? 15 minutes? Yeah, 15 minutes. Nice. Not bad. So I guess if you want your engine rebuilt, just hit X up while he's at work and he'll come just help you out. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now the storm is rolling in and I haven't had time to do the window regulator yet. I did take it out and go take the pictures because at least the cosmetics are done. I just need to finish that window regulator. I stayed at O'Reilly's working with X and them for an hour, maybe an hour and a half, and it was definitely time to roll. I would be very happy to finish the car right now. It wouldn't be a problem at all, but this storm is rolling in. You'll probably see some lightning right over there. There's some right there. The lightning is massive and they're saying we have about 20 minutes before it hits here. So I'm going to get inside. Uh, this is supposed to be the uh, biggest storm yet this year. They're saying ping pong size hail, damage to roofs, people, you know, the usual things that the weather says. It may be nothing and it may be a huge storm. So uh, if it is a huge storm, hope it doesn't hit the cars. And uh, if it's not, I guess we'll try again tomorrow, even though it's supposed to rain forever. So I'm having a lot of problems getting work done. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed my hack job painting. Uh, like I said at the beginning, not a body guy. I uh, don't really ever plan to be. I like doing mechanical things, but uh, we tried. That is it for today, guys. Please like, share, subscribe, do whatever you want to do. And I will talk to you next time. <laughs> What'd you do to your car, Tyler? Oh, wow! It's gonna fall off. <laughs> the wheel? Yeah, but it's gonna you're you're gonna make it. You got room. Oh man, that's so tight. But How's it on the other side? Alright, I think you're gonna have to go your way a little bit, but Yeah, steer your way and go straight up. There it is. That's it. Yeah. Although you still have to get over the hump. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> it's on. You're good. Strap it.